Hey there! So if you'd like to see swatches of the Smashbox Always On Matte Liquid Lipsticks, then please stay tuned. I love it. <laughs> I don't want to take this one off. Mm. <laughs> Hey guys, this is Sneha here from Beauty Lashes 19, helping you put your best face forward. Now today I am excited to swatch some of my favorite liquid lipsticks, which are the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipsticks. Now I have seven shades. Each of these retail for $24, at least on the Sephora website, and that's where I got them from. And I have shades that range from pinks to corals to orange to reds to some deeper plums and burgundy shades. So first let's look at some of the claims of this liquid lipstick. Now as I said, they retail for 24 US dollars each, which is quite steep. And you get about 3.8 ml of product in there or 0.13 ounce of lipstick. They claim it's an 8 hour liquid matte lipstick that's specifically formulated to be comfortable and to not dry out your lips, which I totally agree with. I have on the shade Misconduct, in case you're curious. This is what the packaging looks like, by the way. <laughs> Sorry, I'm all over the place in this video, but these are what the lipsticks look like. They have this beautiful um, glass looking, but I think it's plastic casing at the bottom with the inner tube containing the liquid lipstick and this matte black top which reminds me of NARS packaging but very chic, very classy, yes it's bulky uh, not the most travel friendly just because it's so big but I don't mind it because the formula is superb uh, it twists open and this is what the wand looks like so it has that teardrop shape at the end which helps to pick up a lot of product and therefore for me one dip is enough to cover both my top and bottom lip. So let's go back to the claims of the lipstick. It says it gives lips bold, lightweight color with a liquid matte finish, which I agree except for a couple of shades that I point out during the swatches. All of them go on very smooth and are not patchy. And formulated with advanced polymer technology, it ensures that your lip color lasts up to 8 hours and it won't smudge, budge or feather. I don't know about 8 hours, but they do stay for a very long time, considering um, the other liquid lipsticks that I have. This is probably the longest wearing lip liquid lipstick, if that makes sense. Some of the deeper shades definitely stay on all day, through lunch, dinner, all of that. Um, yes, they do need touch-up, especially towards the inner rim of your lips, but nothing too obvious, so you can get away with just having it on. It's infused with primer oil complex to condition lips, and it features a range of vibrant, highly pigmented shades and a precision tip applicator that perfectly lines and fills in the lip color. So I definitely agree that it has some kind of uh, moisture when you put it on. It does not suck out and dry out your lips like the Colourpop liquid lipsticks, the matte ones I mean. So I definitely think that whatever the primer oil complex is, is definitely conditioning the lips underneath. And it definitely has a beautiful range of shades to pick from. So as of now, they have 20 shades available in this range. And definitely the applicator is beautiful because of the shape of it comes to a point which helps in going to the inner corners of your lips right here and just giving a perfect lip. It's also formulated without parabens and phthalates if that's a concern for you. And this product is cruelty free and formulated without uh, sodium lauryl sulfate and talc. So next I'm going to show you the swatches on my lips. So the first color that I'm swatching is the shade Big Spender. It's said to be a rose shade. It's very comfortable on the lips and it almost dries down quite quickly actually. And went out super pigmented, no issues, no patchiness or anything. I love this shade. So the next shade I have for you is called Let's Dance. And this is another pink shade, but this one has slightly more purple tones to it compared to the first shade. Now, as you can see um, next to each other, this one is more of a brighter pink, while this is a cool tone pink with slightly more purple tones to it. 
Again, the shade, as you can see from the swatch, went on super smooth and just a lot of pigmentation straight from the bullet. I didn't have to layer it or anything. It's a cool toned pink shade, so it's going to make your teeth look whiter, which is a bonus. Who doesn't want that, right? So yeah, this is Let's Dance. The next shade I have for you guys is a bright coral pink and it's called Blast Off and I think it's beautiful for summer. Super bright, super orangey, pinky coral shade and probably this is my least favorite of the lot just because I think this one goes on slightly more sheer and a little bit more patchy than the other shades. So I often use this uh, in the middle uh, when I'm using other deeper shades to add as a brightener almost so that's how I like to use the shade but you could rock the shade on its own so this is the shade out loud and as you can see the application was smooth there are no patches or anything it's just full-on pigmented liquid lipstick it's great for summer and fall I think this is one of the orange shades that you don't have to worry about. I think it's going to suit most Indian skin tones. Next shade is this gorgeous red shade called Boss, which was um, probably the first shade that they came out with, I think. And this is in collaboration with the YouTuber Lily Singh. And if you haven't heard of her, which shouldn't be the case, <laughs> Uh, she's Superwoman, I believe is her idea, and I'll link it in the description box below. But she collaborated with Smashbox and created this beautiful deep red shade. It's again a beautiful red shade that I think is going to suit a lot of Indian skin tones, especially the light to medium skin tones. Next shade I have for you is this gorgeous purple plum shade called Girl Gang. And I always get so many compliments every time I wear this lip shade. So that's Girl Gang. Beautiful shade, I think. The shade will suit every Indian skin tone. Love it. I think this is probably one of my top two or three from this line. It is stunning. So the last shade I have for you guys is called Misconduct. And this this beautiful, um, I'd say a burgundy, reddish, maroonish shade, but they call it a deep, warm plum, I guess. <laughs> this is the shade Misconduct. Again, the shade would suit so many different skin tones, uh, all the way to the deep darkest skin tones, I think, would look stunning in the shade. Yes, the shade does go on a little patchy, as you can see, but I love it. I mean, <laughs> it's more flattering and also uh, more forgiving, I guess, because it's such a deep shade, as compared to that pink shade we tried on, which was Blast Off like this one. So I don't know, I love this shade. This is again one of my top shades from this line. And that's the swatches of all the seven shades I have for the Smashbox Always On Matte Liquid Lipsticks. So I hope these swatches were helpful in picking out shades. I'm also going to insert a picture right now for swatches on the arm so you can see difference between the shades. Don't forget to hit that like button if this video was helpful and also hit that subscribe button. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye!